I'm here again in the heart cry office this morning trying to get some work done before the uh, big snowstorm hits here in Virginia. And um, there was just something that I wanted to share with all of you, especially those of you who are new believers. There are so many good books to read and, and so many good sermons to listen to and, and so many good and godly conversations, but nothing Nothing will replace your private devotions. Nothing will replace reading the Word of God and being devoted to communion with God in prayer. And I really want to encourage you in this. You know, I study many hours a day, you know, trying to uh, understand certain texts and their original language and all these things. But nothing in my life helps me more than simply getting up in the morning and reading five to 15 chapters a day and doing so systematically, reading through the entire Bible. You know, so many people just read the New Testament or so many people just read the epistles. But you know, the prophets, the law, uh, the wisdom literature, the history, everything that is in the Word of God is what you need and you need it all the time. You know, the old preachers used to say something like this, the dust of this book is gold and that is so true. So even though I want you to read good literature and I want you to have godly conversations and I want you to uh, listen to good preachers, more than anything else, I would that you would devote yourself to reading through Scripture systematically, again, from Genesis to Revelation, over and over and over and over again. That's the way that you're going to grow in life, conformity to Christ, and power for ministry. Good day.